Welcome back. If you love to run or if it's just something you want to knock off your bucket list, maybe a half marathon to top it off, you and hundreds, maybe even thousands of other people in Kentucky will have the opportunity to partake in a one-of-a-kind race in Frankfurt happening next weekend. Joining me now, Kentucky Historical Society President Michael Hammonds and Race Rise owner, we have Bob Bainey with us. Gentlemen, great to have you here. Good to be here. This is a big race. We'll get to the details of it in a second. First, the Kentucky Historical Society. I mean, uh, Doug High does Kentucky History Treasures, and it's just awesome. I mean, you have to tune in. So much history in the state, and you guys really put it on display. And the Historical less. Society goes back to the 1830s, so we've been around 180 years. And, wow. And we have more than 500,000 artifacts that, that uh, trace our history going back to the very beginning. Very yeah. neat. Very neat. And this race, obviously, a big fundraiser for the society. Especially uh, helps, helps us in our program costs with the a number of programs that we have, especially for children, uh, education programs, say Camp Artifact or, or the Junior Historical Society. Mm -hmm. uh, it's very important. The proceeds are very important to us to continue those programs and to expand our programs to reach more kids. And also gives running enthusiasts an opportunity to help you guys out, too. So let's talk about mm -hmm. the race. Uh, this isn't your typical 5K. We're going half marathon with this one, too. Tell us a little bit about That's it. That's right. We do have a 5K. We've got a yeah. 5K, a 10K, and mm -hmm. a half marathon. So there's really something for everyone. Mm -hmm. uh, the half marathon's 13.1 miles. So you really need to be trained up for that one yeah. if you're going to do that's, it. That's a big one. You can't roll out of bed and do right. that. <laughs> but it, it, it shows off the very best of Frankfurt. Mm -hmm. And it's such a beautiful, historic town. Um, and it's obviously our state capital. Mm -hmm. We do run around the Capitol building. I was going to say, looking at the course map, I mean, you're running by historical buildings and yep. just the setting of Frankfurt itself, gorgeous, as you're huffing and puffing through mile, you know, 10, 11, 12. <laughs> exactly. We have a mile of remembrance. We run through the Frankfurt Cemetery, which is the second oldest cemetery mm -hmm. in the country. Uh, we run in and around all the historic buildings in downtown, around Buffalo Trace Distillery. Mm -hmm. So it's just, um, there's history everywhere you look. And again, we have something for everyone. Um, all all uh, runners will get a, a performance technical T-shirt, okay. commemorative shirt. Uh, also, all will get a medal. And oh, most five, ten, five Ks and ten Ks don't have a medal. No. So that's very unique in that respect. And, and a nice runners. memento too, exactly. obviously, of the race. So do you suggest people pre-register? Can they show up on race day with their running shoes ready to go? They can. We will take registrations on race day, but we, we encourage them to register in advance. It allows us to be ready for them. They can come to our Friday Expo and Packet Pickup mm -hmm. at the Kentucky Historical Society, get everything done in advance, but we will have the, the availability to register on race day if someone procrastinates to the very last minute. And the easiest way for people to pre-register is? Yeah, KentuckyHistoryHalf.org mm -hmm. is the website. They can go there and just there's a sign-up link and they can take it from there. Very cool. We've got a, a WTVQ10 mm -hmm. is the code, and we'll uh, get that out. That's for 10% off, and it's good through this Friday. So Very we're saving a little money. Well, there you go. I hope you get a great turnout, a great cause. Keep doing what Thank you're you. doing. Keep the history going. Nice work, and uh, we'll see you out there next Saturday in Frankfurt. Thanks, Thanks guys. Thanks so much. Thank well, you. Well, let's look at your forecast coming up right after this.